Yo, what is going on guys? Horcrux here and welcome back to the channel. Guess what fellas? We finally did it! We made an impact in the community, so pat yourselves on the back and let's get into what we did. So, as you guys know, I posted a video a couple weeks ago about a really game-breaking Scoria bug, which, um, just to catch you guys up on the story, is that you can hold as many Scoria meatballs as you want in the air and then uh, with the click of a button you can have them hit someone at uh, any given time and as many meatballs as you want assuming you had enough of them proc and yada yada anyway long story short you can one shot someone and this was true for most projectiles in the game proc sets uh chlorine you do it with i tested uh valken scoria uh there, there's a few others that i uh, i tested and uh it, it's pretty game breaking so i posted a video about it i submitted a bug report and so I tried to get you guys to do the same well you know two three weeks goes by or however long I, I, I posted the video and nothing got done so I was pretty bummed out about it well I was actually about to go to bed today and lo and behold we came across a post on the forum so let's uh let's check it out here guys so this is from the community manager Zoss Jessica Folsom so she says we recently identified and either banned or suspended several hundred ESO accounts for terms of service violations related to cheating. Oh yeah. Specifically, manipulating the game client in unintended ways. <clears throat> we would like to remind everyone that manipulating the game client and using any unapproved third party applications, programs, scripts, or any other game modifying mechanics used to change the gameplay experience is strictly prohibited. Thank you, Zoss, for finally listening. I'm not sure how this got to their attention. Uh, I I guess you guys spam them with bug reports. I don't know. Like, pat y'all selves on the back. Good job. Um, maybe there's a stream somewhere that brought it to their attention or a video somewhere. Or, or, or maybe, you know, our ego is just kind of way up here. You know, did we actually make any impact? Um, who knows? But um, that really doesn't matter. The moral of the story is that uh, they were actually banning people. This is weird because it's kind of the end of the year. Um... You, you, you kind of wouldn't expect that. You know, right now you think, you know, everyone's kind of getting ready for the holidays, you know, taking it easy. And here we have from uh, Jessica Folsom saying, hey, yeah, we're we're tired of y'all shit and we're going to ban you before the holidays. That's awesome. Like, this is, uh, this is cool. Um, does that have a, you know, does that bode well for Zoss going into the New Year's? Uh, who knows? Hard to tell, but uh, this is awesome. Uh, it's the first time we've actually seen something like this. You know, there's a post, you know, a couple months ago about uh, gold and duping and, you know, stuff like that. But uh, this is uh, this is awesome. I feel that we really made an impact with this, guys. And, uh, you know, pat yourselves on the back. Awesome. Thank you all so much for sharing the video or you know, whatever. It reached someone's attention somewhere and they did something about it. Um, have I tried to recreate this bug just to see if it works? No. And I'm actually kind of afraid to now because it's going to be on the radar. So... Probably not an update on that. I was actually going to put out a video Thursday about how you can do the exact same thing with heavy attacks, but uh, I'm probably going to recant that now seeing this post. Um, I'll go ahead and finish reading out here. Uh, but uh, all players who are banned or suspended have received messages from customer support, yada yada. Players who have questions or uh, about being caught <laughs> um, with your pants down, here's a link to where you can apply for your appeal. So uh, this is awesome. Again, guys. Going into the New Year's, you all have to understand that Zoss can't really say much about anything, uh, to my understanding, um, because of NDAs with the uh, the Xbox Game Studios and the you know, Microsoft you know, kind of buying them out. So um, this bodes well going into the New Year's. Um, this, uh, this this made me very erect this morning. I was about to go to bed and I saw this post and I was like, "Wow, this is this is cool. Uh, we did something, guys." So, um, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Am I hyping this up a little too much? Given uh, myself and your guys' self uh, too much credit, you know, uh, knock me off my petted stool if uh, I seem a little, you know, a little up there. But I think we did something good here, guys. So uh, congrats to everyone. And uh, yeah, uh, this has been Horcrux. Don't forget, I'm doing a combat critique series where I critique your 1VXs or PvP clips. And in hopes of making you better at them, I'll tell you what you did right, what you did wrong. Please drop them in the Discord or my email, you know, horcruxeso at yahoo.com. Also, PvP Top 5 Clips. Don't forget, guys. Also, also, shout out to my patrons and also my community members. Thank you all so much for supporting the channel. I just jumped into the good, the, the, the bread and butter way too quick because I was pretty excited to share this with you guys. So, yeah, 
Uh, you guys have a good night. This has been Horcrux, and peace. <laughs>